Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel today. Um, well, today I'm going to be explaining the um, India versus England first T20, which takes place on 12th of March, uh, 1.30 p.m. in England, um, and it's in Ahmedabad. Um, so I'm going to say the... India team and the England team first of all. So let's start. Um, so first is Virat Kohli, the captain, obviously. Rohit Sharma, um, Chahal is a bowler. Deepak Chahal is a bowler. Shikha Dhawan is an opening batsman. Ishan Kishan is a wicketkeeper batsman. Shreya Saya, top order batsman. And just to make everything clear Ishan Kishan is actually a new uh, new batsman for the team um, actually but uh, Bhuvaneshwar Kumar he's a bowler Natarajan he's also a bowler Hardik Pandya all-rounder Rishabh Pant wicketkeeper batsman Aksar Patel bowling all-rounder and my favorite player guys KL Rahul I even made a video on him that actually got 4k views and yeah, I'm really uh, appreciative for that, guys. Thank you so much for that. Anyway, moving on. Navdeep Saini, he's a bowler. Rahul Tawetia, he's also new to the team. He's a bowler. Shardul Takur, uh, he's a bowler. Varun Chakravati, he's also new uh, to the team. Bowler, Washington Sundar, bowling all-rounder. And Suri Kumar Yadav, he's a batsman and he's also new to the team. All right, moving on to the England team. So, um, yeah, let's do this anyways. So, first of all, Oin Morgan, the captain. He's a middle-order batsman. Moeen Ali, batting all-rounder. Jofra Archer, bowler. And just to make it clear, if you want uh, um, if you were um, questioning this, why is Oin Morgan not playing tests? That's because he doesn't play tests. Um, he's not a test batsman. But yeah, uh, Joffre Archer, bowler. Johnny Bairstow, wicketkeeper batsman. Sam Billings, wicketkeeper batsman. Josh Butler, wicketkeeper batsman. Um, Tom Curran, bowling all-rounder. And Sam Curran, two brothers, um, all-rounder. Chris uh, Jordan, bowler. Liam Livingstone, batsman. Um, David Milan, top order batsman. Adel Rashid, bowler. Jason Roy, opening batsman. Ben Stokes, all-rounder. And Reese Topley, bowler. I've never heard of Reese Topley before, but uh, not sure if he's going to play because uh, they haven't announced the full team yet. Um, um, I don't think so. So, And then the last one is Mark Wood. He's a bowler. So now I'll actually be explaining the last five matches that they've played against each other for T20s. So basically, all I'm going to say is India won four out of the five matches. The first one, India won by seven wickets with eight balls remaining. Rohit Sharma was actually the play of the match. Um... England actually had 198 for nine. That is a decent score, to be honest. But then Rohit Sharma came in and he said, I'll do the work. And he got 100 off 56 balls. And yeah, so that's a quick highlight of that match. And then the next match, actually, England won that match by five wickets with two balls remaining. All right. So India didn't have that much of a score with only 148 for five and then alec tails uh with a few other batsmen who got tiny scores uh finished off uh but alex tails got 58 um next so the next one is india won by eight wickets with 10 balls remaining and the player of that match was Kuldeep cool Yadav. So uh, England had a quite calm total, which was 159 for 8. And then it moves on to England, I mean India. And guess what, guys? My favourite player, K. 
KL Rahul got 101. Let's go. 101 of 54, guys. Um, pretty impressive, along with Rohit Sharma's one. Um, anyways, uh, India won by 75 runs, uh, the next one. India got 202 for six. And then everybody got uh, good, good scores. Um, okay, next. And then England, uh, they just got cleaned up. They were starting off good, but then they just, they collapsed. Uh, not a very good match for England anyways. Next, last and final match. India won by five runs. Just by Bumrah was the player of the match this time. And just by Bumrah, okay got two wickets actually and yeah so that's actually gonna be it for my video guys bye